As you mentioned, that behavior all caught on video, Val and Tanya. Those videos have now gone viral. Large, rowdy crowds jumping on cars, jumping on CTA buses. This morning, dozens of people were arrested and two teenagers were shot. Chaos along Michigan Avenue during a beautiful spring night. Large crowds of young people captured on cell phone video running around creating a major disturbance near Millennium Park. When I came back, this whole, this whole area was lined with, this street was blocked off by a, a wall of a police up to the next block. The groups running around jumped on cars, CTA buses, and weaved in and out of oncoming traffic. Then a shooting. Police confirmed two teenagers were shot near Michigan and Wabash. A 16-year-old boy was shot in the arm and a 17-year-old boy was shot in the leg. We've had it almost every year and I just think the, the, the police feel that they don't have support from the, go, you know, from the, the mayor and stuff to, to really do what they have to do. Both Mayor Lori Lightfoot and Mayor like Brandon Johnson responded to the violence. This is not the first time uh, that we've uh, addressed these issues, but our young people have an opportunity um, and, and a right to enjoy the entirety of our city, but they have to do it in a way that is respectful for people and property. And we did address that um, over the weekend and we will continue to address it. Mayor like Johnson called the activity, quote, unacceptable and went on to say, quote, it is not constructive to demonize youth who have otherwise been starved of opportunities in their own communities. The president and CEO of Chicago's Loop Alliance, representing downtown businesses, also released a statement saying in part, quote, we are saddened by the events that occurred in the Loop yesterday evening, and we are prepared to work with all relevant partners and parties in response to when these trends are detected. It wasn't just here in the Loop. Similar problems took place at 31st Street Beach that also ended in violence. A 14-year-old boy was shot in his thigh. In the end, 15 people were arrested. Police say no one is in custody related to those shootings. Watch breaking news on YouTube. Subscribe to ABC7 Chicago Eyewitness News.